what's up here's my next video on how to draw anime poses from reference this time i'll be drawing luffy in his gear 5 form and so right now you see like the with this particular picture it's in um in the foreshortened perspective which was a little would be a little bit more difficult to draw but it's something that's pretty good with practicing with and so as you see with something like this i started out with the head first and then as i went from the head i started working in some of the body and then drew the hand in because the hand is um since, since it's moving forward I, i'll be able to add in all the stuff behind it that way it make it a little, a little a little easier and um and a lot of times when i'm sketching i always sketch out uh, just a just a little outline of of the structure of the shapes of where everything be placed and then i was going with pencil because uh, everything will be raised like the 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 red pencil can be raised and uh the pencil that I'm, I'm sketching with now can be erased and so i usually go in tight with this pencil um like a little tight just not too much just so i can erase enough of it but um enough so i can see the details of what i'm doing that way it'd be easily erasable and sometimes when i'm doing it i don't really erase a lot like i'll leave it there but um for this i kind of just since i'm just you know something i'm just warming up with or or, or practicing with i just lay it all down and then worry about fixing it up later just like with the hand i think the hand is is in the picture reference picture is a little bit higher and in the one i drew it's, it's like a tad bit lower but it's like a simple change i can just easily erase the hand which, I mean, you'll see me do it soon but i'll just erase it and uh, just change it up it's always uh good to change up things if you don't like it or keep it if you want it i mean i could i could have just kept it if i want to since i'm not really uh, getting too serious with it i could just you know leave it like it is so right now i'm adding in the clouds and for clouds it was uh it wasn't really a challenge it's mostly a lot of overlapping shapes with the uh little little circles making the circle going in it's, it's almost like you're making the clouds since his hair his hair is like cloud and and um he has a cloud aura around him and i'm going in with that with the hand making his fists not too big and then adding in the clothing around it then normally i would go in um i'll go in sometimes with it with the marker but um most of the time i like to just make make little sketches and at some point when i you know go back to the drawing sometime in the future i'll go back and then uh, ink it up or light table it and ink it just so i can have um, an ink version and also a, a pencil version so i can have like multiple versions in case if I, if I mess up with the marker i always if i have that that trace version from the light table i can just go back to it and retrace it again my original work to um to fix it all up right now i'm going in with the shading which i like to do with the um cross hatching i didn't cross hatch it too much i just went with the straight lines and sometimes i'll go over it with the more cross hatching have the lines going a different direction and it all depends on the type of drawing that i'm doing i think i drew a picture um i drew guts from berserk and I add in a whole lot of cross hatching in that one just because, you know, with the Berserk characters, those require a, a lot of detail, a lot of shading. And also some screen tones, which I might start using in some of these videos. So when I'm going in, I'm adding in all the finishing touches to it. Like his sandals and his the scar on his chest and his pants and the last minute clouds. As you see, I didn't really, I already knew from drawing the clouds before how to sketch in the other ones without even using a, a previous sketch line to get it all in. But that's it for this video. If you want to see more like this or another type of anime you want me to draw, just like button, subscribe, take care.